Hey people, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play I Wanna Kill the Camellia 2. So, in the last episode, we completed stage 6, which was already really challenging. But now, we are onto the boss rush of stage 6. So, without further ado, Let's get to the first boss. Okay, um, what... What is that? I cannot... Okay, you shoot that. Okay. That, that is a bit confusing, but okay. Um, okay, so we've got this little ball with four weapons. Now, each weapon, I assume, has... A different attack and you have to shoot the moving spike in order to damage him and by the way this Toho music so that's good um, so there's the yellow attack this one looks fairly simple alright and yeah yeah this this boss actually doesn't seem too bad up until now, I hope. <laughs> Alright, so there's the purple attack, and... Holy moly, that looks... That is confusing. Oh god, I think that one is the hardest. Yeah, that one is by far the hardest yet. Phew. <laughs> The red attack seems fairly simple. It is basically just avoiding. And then there's this, which... Well... For one, the cherries aim at you, but then there's also... The waves that occasionally just... Uh, not occasionally, but, but constantly just come down at you. And... And those, these red cherries can give you a really bad pattern. But yeah, purple is very complicated. And the spike doesn't make it better. But you know, if it's just gonna be these four attacks for the entire boss fight, then I'm actually gonna be a bit disappointed. Because that will be very boring. Just these four. But you, you, you never know. You never know what's gonna happen. Especially in this game. I keep thinking that this spike is gonna bounce back. That was close. That was very close. Uh, am I making progress? I think I am. That was... Just... Bad. No. Bad. That shouldn't have happened. You know, for the yellow attack, it's really hard to tell which... Cherries are gonna bounce and which aren't. And that is... Bad. One weird thing about this boss is that I don't know when I'm making progress. So I don't really know if I'm doing good or not. But whenever I just get quite far or survive for a certain amount of time I feel like that is progress but surviving long and progress isn't the same thing because progress is the damage so and if you survive long it doesn't mean you actually like did a lot of damage most of the time it does but yeah but I think that was progress. It might have been. 
Okay, whatever you do, just don't lose track of the spike. The spike is a very essential part to this battle. It, because if you lose sight of it, then the next time you see it, it's probably going to be in your face. Or the cherries. The, that, the, that same rule counts for the cherries. See? <laughs> exactly. Alright, there's a secret to every attack. For the purple one, it's that you should pretty much only pay attention to the cherries that are homing in on you. And then just glance at the wave to make sure you're safe. But mainly it's just the ones that are homing in on you that you should pay attention to. The red one specializes in trapping you on the sides. And if it does manage to do that, then it's really easy to screw you over. So the blue attack specialty is trapping you in between the small cherries with the big cherries. So what you mainly have to pay attention to in the blue attack is the big blue cherries. They really have the power to just mess you up. Like there. If I didn't move there, I would have been gone. So, just only avoid the big blue ones and then just go with the small ones. Just avoid the small blue ones like your second nature. Just don't even worry about them. Main focus are the big blue ones. Oh, it's gone! Oh! The blue attack is gone. Ooh. Now that is definite progress. Ah, and the yellow one. The yellow attack is so... so hard. There's no real trick to it, it's just hard. So the only real trick I could think of for the yellow attack would be to just imagine that they all would bounce. Because some of them bounce and some of them don't. So you just have to expect all of them to bounce. Just to not be surprised by anything. But, you know, sometimes you just get really overwhelmed with that attack, so I really don't know of any easy way to handle this. I mean, none of the attacks are easy to handle with, but some are easier than others. You see, there. There I got surprised, because I did not expect that one to bounce. Even though I should've, because I should expect all of them to bounce. Which would should make it easier for me, but it's just so much for my brain to handle. You know, I don't know why I'm shooting so much. This boss has invincibility frame, so there's literally no point in me doing this. But still, I do. And I don't really know why. Maybe it's just because I'm bored. Uh... Like, literally, there's no point. I don't get why I'm doing this. Why? Unleash your inner cherry. Unleash your inner Miku. Come on, you got this. Oh, nope, never mind. I get so little time to practice the purple phase 
because it just never appears. It's just so rare. And then there's yellow, of course. Yeah, there's, then, then there's just yellow. But you know, honestly, there's not really many bad things I can say about this boss fight. It's just boring, that's all the bad things about it. It's just boring and takes a while, but... It's, it's not that poorly designed. I mean, it's kind of not very creative, but... It's, it's, it's okay, I suppose. And you know, all you need is just patience and skill. Two things that I don't necessarily have. Right now. Or anytime soon. So close! So close to beating Blue again. But this time I also had some damage on the other weapon, so I think that might be progress. Did I just get double yellow? I just got double yellow. Oh god. Did I just survive double yellow? I think I just survived double yellow. Boo! Damn, I'm on fire. Please, I didn't mean it like that. Ugh. Oh, music change. What? Please don't kill. Please. What is this? I'm being good. I'm actually... <laughs> I was I was so happy. So happy. You know, may I just point out that one of his weapons is a sink? Yeah, a freaking sink. What what why? Why? What is a sink doing there? Even if it's purple. Just, just chill. Huh. Oh, double purple. Even better. Oh nice! It's dead! Finally I killed I killed the weapon again. Oof. Don't kill, please. Nice one! Oh god, finally! Finally I killed a weapon again. Whew. Maybe that's progress, I think. But yeah, that, that was still pretty good. Oh, red, buddy, pal, please. That is... weird? I killed it, and it killed me. Is that called equal trade? Oh! Yellow is down! Purple is down! I am down! Oh! Lee! That was intense. Two weapons down, the most annoying ones at that. Well, purple isn't really annoying, but it's pretty hard. So, that was, that was very good. Nice! Oh, 
Oh god, I'm afraid of yellow. You got this. Never mind. No, why? Why did I do that? That was entirely my fault. I have no idea why I did so badly there. Oh man, I could have ended it right then and there. Nice. Just the perfect dodge. You 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 just nailed it. You just nailed that one. That was beautiful. Why? No, why? No, why? Why did you die there? Ah, no. No. It took so long to get here as well. Oh, what? Focus. No, no, why? Ah, I didn't focus hard enough. I didn't focus hard enough. Of course, just take the dodge vs. totally... That makes totally no sense and is way riskier and just generally doesn't benefit you in any way. <laughs> Except for making you survive, but hey. You know, you could do that in, with any other dodge. Plus it didn't even look cool. It was just weird. Ah, uh, yellow into red. The most beautiful transition in the world. Can you, can you hear the sarcasm in my voice? I think it's strong in this one. Uh.
Oh, is Red going to die? Well, seems like I live to see another day. Yes! Yes! Warp! It's dead! It's dead! It's finally dead! Whew! Jeez! That was intense! Whew! Wow! I didn't actually expect to beat this boss on the second try of the last attack. That was very nerve-wracking. Holy man. I, I, I'm quite at a loss for words. That, that was a pretty interesting boss. Only at four attacks, but still it was pretty interesting. Phew. Anyway, that was the boss. I believe it is from I want to be the destination, so, yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so, in the next episode, this boss that I am now standing on top of, who will it be? Well, again, I have no clue, <laughs> but, till then, bye viewers.